Hey folks, Alex McMahon here of Evolved Nutritional Therapy. This is going to be video five in your holiday survival guide. And we're going to be discussing today is how to get back on track after an overindulgence. So the biggest thing that I want to keep in mind for a lot of people is that treats should be worth it. If you're going to do it, you should do it big. You should do it for something that's fancy, that's well worth it. Don't overindulge on something like crappy chocolate chip cookies or something like that. You know, if you're going to do it, make it something that's actually worth it, that you're going to enjoy, that you're going to be happy that you indulged and went for it. That's the first thing. The next thing is to get rid of the guilt. One of the biggest things is that the guilt and the stress that you're going to cause over one night of overindulgence is actually going to be way worse for you on a physiological level than the actual food that you consume. Now, you may weigh a little bit more, you may feel a little bit more bloated the next day. Now, two or three days later, once that's all passed though, you're gonna return back to normal. Don't stress about the small blips that happen and the small overindulgences, but if these overindulgences become something that are on a much larger scale happening uh, four times a week, you may, need to, you may need to take a step back and reassess things. But the biggest thing is to not feel guilt over any of the food that you've had. You should never feel guilt because you made a choice and in that moment, that is exactly what you wanted. So don't ever feel guilty about it, uh, but make sure it's worth it. Make sure it's something that you actually are gonna enjoy, you're gonna look back and be happy that you indulged on that, not drank a little bit too much and then had you know chocolate chip cookies that were from Safeway or something like that. The next big thing is to get back on track the next day. So far too often when people do overindulge, they end up letting it kind of landslide into a few days of overindulgence. So if you do decide to overindulge one night or it happens by accident, make sure that the very next day you do get back on track to prevent the kind of yo-yo dieting that a lot of people end up having troubles with. The next things that you can do are gonna be pretty specific. Uh, so for the next few days, you're gonna really wanna focus on protein, vegetables, fat, and getting enough water in. So you're gonna make sure that you're gonna provide these foods that are high satiety foods. You're gonna get lots of fiber, lots of water, lots of vitamins, lots of minerals. Um, you're gonna provide ample protein to keep you fuller for longer. Um, so these are all gonna be really helpful things to kind of help you get back on track. They're also gonna help you to curb some of the cravings that can happen from overindulgences. So sometimes when people choose to overindulge, they actually end up with a few days worth of cravings afterwards. So by having these higher satiety foods and making sure that you're better hydrated by getting enough water, you're gonna be able to kind of squelch these cravings while you return back to normal habits. The last thing to talk about is to realize that it's more about your trends than it is snapshots. So one night of overindulging out of you know a month or two nights of overindulging out of a month are really gonna be a small blip in the progress that you've made. And by mentally beating yourself up over those two slip ups, you're gonna be you're gonna be providing a much larger challenge to you staying on track long term than accepting those, realizing that you enjoyed yourself, you had a little bit of fun, and moving on. So that's it for video five. In video six, it's gonna be the bonus video where I'm gonna show you how to prevent the holiday hangover using a couple smart steps and food choices, but then also I have a little preventing the hangover recipe I'm gonna be giving you that's time tested and proven. So thanks for watching and click the link in the description to get the bonus video for preventing the holiday hangover. See you hey folks, one last thing. I'm offering a free 30 minute nutrition phone strategy session. What we can do is we can figure out exactly where you are right now, where your goals are at, and then what the roadblocks are that are preventing you from getting to your goals. So if you click the link in the description, there'll be a small form for you to fill out. We'll hop on the phone and we can get you moving closer to your goals in a sustainable fashion based on what is right for you. So go ahead and click that link in the description, fill out the form, hop on the phone, and let's get you closer to your goals. Thanks for watching.